Oh wow, this is the best one so far. You can see the emoji, the shading, and the overall polish clearly better than the previous two. Many of you know the term AI employees, but in many cases it's hard to explain what this really means. Most people just say, well, an AI employee is a kind of like an assistant and other things along those lines. In this video, however, we're going to test Meta GPT X MGX, a platform designed for coding that works in a more structured way. It has several AI employees, a team leader, deep researcher, product manager, architect, engineer and data analyst all collaborating to get your small app or MVP built according to the description this platform is for people who want to quickly build something a full stack product to validate ideas and get to market fast and we're going to see how this tool works let's dive into meta GPT X let's dive Deep. Just by looking at this interface, I can already spot a few things. For one, you can switch between team and one engineer mode. Depending on the depth and complexity of your project, you can make this choice. Since we are here to push MGX to its limits, let's stick with team mode and explore the rest. Here we have race and deep research. I know what deep research is, but what's race mode? Okay, I see. It allows you to run the same prompt across multiple models at the same time and compare their outputs. All right, before we begin building the app, let's first test this deep research feature. What is it exactly? Let's click on this healthy diet planning option and let Iris, an AI employee, conduct the research for us. Research is an important part of any project creation so you can see that right now iris is gathering data for us by the way while i'm waiting i want to show you this article i found on mgx.dev i'm sure you've seen how deep research is handled by gemini OpenAI, and other llms but it looks like mgx performs significantly better overall you can see the details on the screen feel free to check this yourself just type in the url you see on the screen anyway the research is completed you can see see what it looks like and now back to the main task let's create an application build a simple diet tracking app send the process has started and almost instantly the team lead has finished his part and passed it to Alex the engineer it looks like the app is finished let's test it look at this pizza unhealthy apple healthy candy unhealthy rice moderate mm beans healthy so the app is working let's try to improve this product let's see now the data analyst is analyzing the current food classification system and structure and the product manager is working on the improvement plan once this is completed i expect higher data accuracy and improved product analysis the app has been improved and i see there is now a section showing confidence level great however i noticed that one out of five employees didn't work let me try to ask our team lead to engage this last guy bob the architect make bob work and contribute to the project bob is now working on data analysis documents this so-called architect is building a comprehensive system architecture for the improved diet tracking app his primary focus is on scalability and maintainability okay the app is now improved it has a scalable microservices design advanced food classification system performance and scalability optimization security and privacy and a phased implementation roadmap let's publish this app i'm going to click publish and here it is live and ready to be shared by the way look at this shark meat isn't that healthy after all so don't eat sharks 
Before I go, I want to show you how race mode works. Race mode lets you run the same prompt across multiple models at the same time and compare their outputs. Let me quickly demonstrate that. Create a simple retro style snake game. As you can see, multiple models are working on this task. Simultaneously, you can watch the process in real time. Speed and approach vary depending on the model, but you can recognize the same employees working in each open window. It's actually fun to observe how each model tackles the same problem differently. Quant 3 Coder Plus is moving a bit faster. Cloud Sonnet 4 is next in line. Let's check the final results. Quant 3 has just finished the task. Let's try to play the game. Now let's test Cloud Sonnet 4. This one looks more like a real snake game, definitely better than Quen's version. Deep Seek is ready too, while GPT-5 is still working on the task. Oh wow, this is the best one so far. You can see the emoji, the shading, and the overall polish clearly better than the previous two. I thought Cloud Sonnet 4 would beat all other LLMs, but I was wrong. I was wrong. Deep Seek Seek is way ahead and GPT-5 still hasn't finished. So you never really know which LLM will deliver the best results until you can compare them side by side. And now that's finally possible with MGX. MGX is essentially an easy and structured way to build a small app or an MVP that's well researched, well designed and well built. The entire app creation process took me very little time and I enjoyed every single minute. There are no bugs, no roadblocks, so you can expect the ride to be smooth. As for pricing, you can start for free and test the tool. For more credits and additional features, check out the Pro and Max plans. Details are on the pricing page. That's it for now. I hope you enjoyed the video. Leave your thoughts in the comment section. I'm done for now and I'll talk to you soon. Ivan KV out.